All right, here we are in Adobe Illustrator, and I'm going to show you how to use the Snap to Point uh, feature. So what we've got here are, uh, you know, we, we've got two shapes, and we're going to click on this corner here, and that's the anchor point. So that's the point when it's Snap to Point. And you bring it over here, and you want it to snap, but it's not. It's showing there's another anchor point, but it's not snapping. Um, so, uh, and you, this, the, you may have the uh, bounding box on, which is right here, so that makes it a little harder. So if you do have that on, Go over here and click on it first, and then you can you, you move it around. But um, for this, I'm going to shut the bounding box off, uh, just for the sake of this. And then we're going to go up here to View, and we're going to go to Snap to Point. Now if I grab this and I bring it down here, it's going to snap. Watch. See? Boom. It got that little uh, triangle, and it clicks in there. It wasn't clicking in before. It was just kind of like assuming. But bam. See that? So that's what you want. Um, and then now, there is another similar thing, but it is... Similar but different. Um, it's called uh, Smart Guides. So we're going to turn Smart Guides on. And you can bring this up here and you can see that it's going to like put it together. Oh, okay. So it makes assumptions for you. But sometimes, see, it, it aligned it. But it didn't necessarily snap to the point because um, it's just assuming. So if you're working in intricate, intricate artwork and you're just moving things around, it'll do that for you automatically and it's terrible. So um, it, can be the, it can be the best thing and it can really make things almost impossible <laughs> weird but true so we're snapping the point again and then um i will show you this one more trick you can go up here to settings and go to selection and anchor display and you can make the tolerance more so you, you can go up to eight and then the snap to point uh, so that's the grabbing the anchor point and then this is um snapping so you can make that all the way up to eight too and now it's just a little snappier that's all you don't have to be so perfect on the anchor point, you can you can get see I'm pretty far off of it and I still got it right and then snapping so you know you can you can make it more or less if you're in really intricate artwork you don't want a big uh, you know margin of of snapping around but if you want a little one you know then that's how you change it so hey hopefully that helped uh, if it did hit like leave a comment thanks.